I want to welcome you to the Ask Jeff YouTube channel. Here's today's question. The Vespian era coin, AD 70, depicts the goddess Roma sitting upon a throne of seven hills. Could John possibly have used this as a cryptic illusion or visual aid for the churches in Revelation chapter 17, verse 9? Now, you get to Revelation chapter 17, it's actually talking about a term known as Mystery Babylon. And there is this mysterious woman that rides a beast. She is dressed in scarlet, she has a golden cup, and there are some blasphemies and all kinds of horrendous things in regards to her. It's very anti-Christ-ish. Now, Many people speculated, why is it that it says this woman sits on a city of seven hills? Is this an illusion? Is this a metaphor? And per the question, there's a coin out there showing this Roman goddess sitting on these seven hills. Well, what we know as the city of Rome is actually known as the city of seven hills. So this really isn't a, shall we say, Roman mythological goddess scenario versus biblical concept. This is just basic geography and history. Rome is known as that place of, quote, seven hills. So when you go to Revelation chapter 17 and you read passages such as this, what we discover is that Rome will have a major impact and influence in those last day scenario. In the very next chapter, chapter 18 of Revelation, it talks about Babylon per se, like the literal Babylon, not just mystery Babylon. And so we know that the Babylonian area will have a significant impact and influence as well. One of the greatest dangers that we have when studying scripture is to look at something and say, well, I know what it says, however, it must mean this, or we make it into something that is illusionary, metaphorical, illustrative, when in this case, Rome is just the city of seven hills, it can actually be what it says. Great question. If you have one, send it to askjeff.net. Maybe your question will be tomorrow's. Thanks for being a part of today's daily question. Now, we answer a question each and every day. Please feel free to submit a new question at askjeff.net. We may not have gotten to yours today, but we eventually will continue to be a part of this. Subscribe so you don't miss out on a question every day.